Our first step on getting you a new home is the inspection period. We typically have 10 days to do so. I'm going to be providing you a list of three different inspectors for you to call and I need you to schedule the inspection as soon as you possibly can. I typically like to get the inspection done within the first few days of our inspection period. The inspector is a general inspector. He is not a licensed contractor. So he's coming in to take a look at the home overall to make sure that there's no big issues going on with the property. If they find that there's something major wrong and recommend that we get a licensed contractor out, we will then have time to do so within those 10 days. How the inspection works is the inspector takes usually about three to four hours to go through the property. During the last hour, we will join them to do a final walkthrough and they will walk us through everything that they have discovered and with photos and detailed descriptions. Within 24 hours, we will receive the detailed inspection report. At that time, we can go through and put our list together of the items that we would like to request that the seller repair. Once we've put our list together of items we would like the seller to repair, we are gonna be sending over what is called the Buyer Inspection Notice Seller Response, or the Binzer. Once we do so, the seller will have five days in which to reply. Now keep in mind, they are taking that time typically to get quotes on the different items we may have requested, so it can take the full five days for them to get back to you. And once they get back to you, they will either respond with they're going to fix it all, they're gonna fix a few items, or they have chosen to not fix any. So at that time, you will then have five days to respond back of whether you want to continue forward with the terms of the contract. Now remember, the seller is not obligated to repair any of the items. So we want to make sure when we go through the list that we're not picking on the ticky tacky things. We're looking at the major components that would impact your decision to purchase the property. During the same inspection period within three days, we are going to receive something called the SPUDS. It's the seller's property disclosure statement. And in this document, the seller is required to disclose anything true they know about the property, any material things that would impact your decision in purchasing the property. You will then have five days once you receive this document to determine if you still wanna move forward with the contract. Also within five days of contract acceptance, we will also receive something called the insurance claims history report. Now this document is from the seller's homeowner insurance and it gives us the past five years history if there was any claims made against the property. And finally, during the inspection period, please reach out to your insurance company to ensure that you can receive homeowner's insurance on the property. They will provide you documentation that we will send over to title so that it's all in place when we close on the home. Congratulations again on your accepted offer. Please don't hesitate to call if you have any questions during this process. My number is 480-369-0072 and have a great day.